I have a friend who I think is in an abusive relationship. They don't think they are. And that's, I think that's the worst situation possible because they just think, they just think that this is normal and good for them and you really can't do anything about it. They'll just get offended if you tell them that this is domestic abuse you are under. We're seeing toxic behaviour like this and worrying about our friends' relationships a lot. But it's hard to know what to do when you're treading a fine line. Trying to be a friend without saying the wrong thing or worrying about upsetting them. And what if we don't know how to help them? What if we do and then they just don't listen? We're desperate to be there for them, but there are just so many barriers. And we're not alone in thinking this. Through the Your Best Friend project, we've been speaking to hundreds of other girls, young women and non-binary people. 71% of them have seen their friend in a toxic relationship. I think in theory, we would all like to think that we would feel brave and talk to our friend. But in practice, it can be so much harder. It can't be like this. We want young people to have what they need wherever they turn. All young women, girls and non-binary people should be confident to spot toxic behaviour and know when to say, that's not right. And most importantly, they should know how to help their friends in that situation. So we've been working together to create a campaign so other girls and non-binary people feel powerful, not powerless, when they want to help a friend. Now we need your help. Once we create the hashtag friends can tell campaign, the videos, the posters, the social media posts and the tools, we need your help to get them out there. Can you help us spread the word?